Ta-da! Look at that beauty. Hello and welcome back to The Infected. I'm Cookie and today is, I think, going to be a building episode. We're going to be planning defenses. We're going to be building maybe a new section on the house. And we are definitely going to be building the new tech, or at least some of the new tech that we got last episode. So the advanced workbench, maybe the chemistry table, and I'm dead. Ah, I'm stuck. And I'm definitely going to be building a food prep table. All right, let's get to it. Yeah, so we got all this from our <laughs> expedition. Just take out the pertinent things for now. Yes, yeah, so this side is going to be the forge area, forge, workbench, chemistry table. The other side is going to be kitchen and all that sort of stuff. So that should be fun. All right, so not putting the iron. Oh, I got lead. Okay. So we'll put the copper in. We'll put that in there. Oop. That in there. And that in there. Actually, what am I doing? I've got the big one. I'm an idiot. But we all knew that anyway. So here we go. We put... This. Oh, okay, well that went somewhere. Put that in there. That. And that. And that. And I think using lead and iron on... Light it up first, Cookie. Oh my god. There we go. I think using lead and iron on here. No. Not on here. Okay. Um, is it on the anvil? Steel alloy. There we go. So yeah, you can make steel. Okay, so let's... <gasps> Advanced workbench. Which way around does it go? That way. Ten planks, two iron, two copper, and ten nails. Alright, so we have nails in here. Two iron, two copper. Not that. Two iron, two copper. And planks. Which means chopping trees. Chopping trees! What do we need for the prep table? Nope, that's under food. Two log, ten plank, ten nails. Okay. Look at that beauty. All right. <laughs> what else? We got the chemistry table. Oh, lead ingot. Okay. Uh, la, 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 la. Yeah, I'll we'll have to make some of these up as well. Uh, prep table. Two log, ten plank, ten nail. So I'll do that here for now. What else? What else? What else can we build? Furniture. Ooh, armchairs. Nice. Okay. I want to build one of these. Okay. We'll go put it down. Is this... Ooh. No. Because this doesn't need... Uh, la 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 la. Power. Let's go dump it down all the way over here. We're going to make screws, which you made from copper. So... That's fun. Well, that's doing all that. I think it was 20. Let's have a look again. 20 screws, yeah. One, two. So yeah, this thing um, is what we need the biofuel for. And it is also what we'll get as ingots. Well, not ingots, sorry, ore. Because 
as you can see, we are out of all rocks here. Which kind of sucks. But ta-da! Food prep bench is done. <laughs> Go chop down another tree. So yeah, this is pretty much going to be a grind episode. Right, building. Same thing, right? <laughs> we may even visit one of the other ore areas. Because I want to get some aluminium. Because that means I can make the big water bottle. Now, I don't actually know if that ore extractor will get all types of ore from one area. So, I don't know. Dude, what? Dude, what? So, yeah, I don't know if I have to go to multiple different places to get all the different ores. What else was it? Eight planks. Iron ingots are gonna be pain. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, oh ten. Okay. There's the oh my god. <laughs> oh, we need a quick way of moving ingots. So yeah, we are currently on day five. So we really, really need to start putting up some form of defense. So maybe I'll hold off in the kitchen. Yeah, I might. Because a lot of work goes into the defense work. It's just a pain. Such a pain. I will see what happens. I mean, this is me after all. I need eight more ingots. Which means we're going to have to go and get some rocks as well. God, stuff's just falling everywhere. Right, let me have a look what I've got in the way of food. Okay, yeah. So, where's my empty cans? There we go. We got three. Okay. So, if we go to food, we can make a veggie salad. Actually, I can't because I don't have potato. And, well, we can make the fruit salad, which is pretty damn good for carbs and thirst. So, it's a watermelon slice and a melon half. So, if I look up... I need to half the melon. Oh, dude, really? I have baked potato. I don't have raw potato. Harvest. Wait. You little. Anyway, so that went there. <laughs> okay. Melon half, watermelon half, and a can. Now we try and get this one. Pick it up. Yep. Nice. And do it again. There we go. So those last four hours. Let's see if we can find some potato. Oh, potato. And we got corn. And yeah, I know I'm thirsty. Cucumber. Watermelon. <gasps> no! Okay, so I can pick up one half. Let's eat some carbs. Just go up there, please. And I can pick that up now. I'm not seeing any potatoes around here. I'll have to plant some. And wait for them to grow. Another thing to build. You also need aluminium to make the cans. Which is, yeah. Great. Really? <laughs> okay, mate. Let's plan defenses. Defenses are basically wooden fence. This, yeah, this isn't exactly square. There's the back of my house. Yeah, I should be able to swing it there. Now these, we will obviously move later on.
Well, that went in wrong. Hmm. Where am I going to want to take this? Yeah? And I have to remember to put in a gate as well. Okay, there's that. And gate, gate, where's the gate? Where's the gate? Oi. Oh, there it is. Bye bye. That looks like it fits. Maybe. She'll be right, mate. Okay, so the gay takes four copper ingots and twelve logs. And each of these takes six logs and four rope. So let's get to making rope. Now, where did the rest of those go? There they are. Rope is surprisingly heavy. And then we're going to put spikes outside. But, you know, the spikes can be broken as well. So you gotta... I'll have to make a repair hammer. And there's also that upgrade hammer I'm going to try out. I wonder if we actually have enough rope for all of this. Maybe. Maybe not. We'll see. Wow! I did make enough rope. Nice. Alright. It was four copper, right? And then we got four left. Yeah. Still need planks for stuff. Let's go chop down trees. Chop down trees. But yeah. Uh, the spikes take, like, insane amounts of sticks as well. Right, that's gonna be fun. There's our gate. That's what the fences are like. So as you can see, it's going to take a hell of a lot of work. Ooh, is that potato? Potato! Okay. That's a bear over there. Stay away. You got the right idea, Mr. Sheepy. He's stuck. Gonna have to make a new axe soon. Don't tell me that's a wolf as well. No, that's a deer. That's fine. Yeah, it almost seems like as soon as you start building defenses, things come. I wonder if that's in the code. Oh damn, we're really slow. Keep an eye out. You stay away, Mr. Yogi Bear. I don't want to deal with you. What do we got to eat? Not much in the way of proteins. Drink. Get your carbs. Finally get the cam back, which is nice. Okay, so what was it to make? The veggie. Corn, potato, cucumber. Okay. We can do that. Corn, potato, cucumber, and an empty can. Bidoop. Nice. Oh, another good thing about this cart, and one reason you take it everywhere with you, is bears, wolves, vambies, that sort of thing. You can stand on it and hit them. So yeah, I think I'm going to be working through the night. <laughs> Fences are done. Spikes. God, I can't see it all. There we go. 
Think about the spikes. You can't exactly uh, stab through the fence to whatever's on the other side. <laughs> Makes things a little interesting. But these do kill the Vambies, which is nice. But the Vambies can also make them explode, which is not so nice. I think you got a 20% chance. And we're back around to the gate. So each of these, one rope, four sticks, one log. Okay, let's go get our rope. We'll need more. There's the rope. And we'll take another one of those. That should be enough. Let me go around and one, two, three, uh, three, four, ah. I miss one there. Freak, I heard a bear. I don't see a bear, but I heard a bear. Okay. I'll just freak out. That, that, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Oh shit, there you are. No, let me in. Thank you. Well, you were there. Hello? I don't know where he's gone. So some of these I have put far enough under that I can actually do them from in here. Other ones are not. What's wrong with this? Protein. Hey, Mr. Bear. Come here. I want to kill you. Where did you go? Monsieur Teddy Bear. Hmm. Well, that's a little frustrating. Right. But yeah, so I've put some sticks. There you go. That's what the spike traps look like. Stabby, 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 stabby. <gasps> there we go. Thank you. Let's go cook some meat. It's still raining. Bloody hell. Alright, let's go get some more stuff. Okay. Yep, drop. Harvest. Now, as you know, harvesting a log gives you firewood and sticks. So we get five sticks, four firewood, yada, yada, yada. Well, my other stick went there it is. But, if you harvest firewood, you get another four sticks from each firewood. How cool is that? And that's how we're going to get the sticks we need for this. So you can get 25 sticks. 25 sticks from one log. Little, little fortress is done. <laughs> we shall be safe for now. 
So, now you can see all this. I want to say thank you for being here with me and through this today. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, I have a little tutorial series that I've been doing if you need some help in different sections of the game. Uh, so that's in the card just up above. <laughs> hope to see you all next time. Bye!